everyone. I am Manvita Mandi and I am in 6th grade. I am 11 years old. So if I want to introduce myself to you all, then the first thing that I can say about myself is I am a bookworm. I am a really hardcore bookworm. So actually I love reading because it transports me into a different world where I can see with the character's eyes and I can also feel with the character's heart. It's a really amazing experience and one day I thought, why can't I give the same experience to other people? Basically meaning, why can't I write a book? So I discussed this idea with my maternal grandfather named Mr. Uh, Jakka Tata Rao. He lives in Pitabram, so I told this to him and he was marveled at this and he really supported it. So he took me to Apparagaru who is an experienced writer in Telugu and he writes Telugu poems. So Apparagaru gave me a lot of advice on how to write a novel. For example, he told me not to end a novel with a tragic accent. Because uh, ending a novel with a tragic aspect would be like an unfinished story and even the reader would also feel really melancholic uh, by everything. And there would not be a proper explanation for the unfortunate demise. So I kept that in mind and I did not uh, end it with a tragic one. And instead I put a harmonious ending to my book. So that is one of the advice that he has given me. I was intrigued and captivated by this insightful talk and I really just like wanted to write a book so eagerly so that's why I did a lot of research on how to start a book, how to end a book and I really started understanding about the characters and the reader's perspectives so I worked really hard to write this novel and for every sentence I made sure that it was perfect and grammatically correct. So finally I was done writing the book, I wrote it in my summer holidays and I am proud to show you the finished book in my hand. So this is the design cover and at the starting I also wrote some acknowledgements, uh, like th a thank you note. So this is actually the second edition of my book. So my handwriting teacher CCRT Prasad sir was really excited when he got to know that I had written a novel and it was told by my tate garu. So because of this amazing news and because of my milestone, he actually hosted a fellow station for me. So these are the pictures which are in my novel in the second edition. And the chief guest was the former MLA of Pitapuram, SVSN Barmasar. And I'm really grateful to both of them because they have hosted my fellow station. And I felt really happy that I was receiving so much applause, approval, praise, and awe. It was just a really rewarding and accomplished feeling. So this fell station was done by Puruhotik Cultural Association, uh, Manauru Manabadhyata, at Sri Surya Raya Vidyananda Library, Pitapura. I was really overwhelmed by seeing the crowd. It was buzzing with excitement and there were so many people eagerly waiting to see me. So there were a lot of students from different schools, headmasters, principals, etc. And it was a really rewarding experience. Bye everyone. So this is all about my milestone. And I hope that by seeing me, you will also acknowledge your own aspirations or ambitions. And I hope that you will develop those and grow greater in the future. Thank you for listening.